I've always been fascinated by beauty. In, it comes in many forms. It comes in shadows, color, landscapes, people, children. You can name it. You can take a whole day naming how you find beautiful, place, beautiful things from places. Uh, my name is Costa Juang. I am 29 years old. I'm a Kenyan living in Nairobi. I'm a visual artist. I paint primarily using acrylics on canvas. I also use charcoal and graphite on paper. I started painting when I was in Kisumu. I was living with my brother and then he was running an NGO which I was part of. After I finished my schooling, I enrolled for a competition in Nairobi called the Manjano Art Competition because I was actually planning to move to Nairobi. And then luckily I was a runner-up in the competition. And then they gave me some money and then I used that to move to, to Nairobi because I did something to facilitate my stay here before I found my way in town, especially in um, I've done so much um, painting-wise and I always say to myself that I always learn things, I keep learning. And if I would name one best work, um, that would be really hard, but I have one uh, one piece of work that I did that I have a lot of sentimental attachments to, and I did it in 2017 when we were going towards election. And it's a, it was a, paint, a painting speaking about peace and Kenya as a country and how fragile the time was. So I feel like it was one of the most powerful paintings that I've done. I started. I have my own studio around Gong Road, so I started um, a mentorship program for young kids. It's not as extensive as it should be, but it works. So I have kids come down to the studio when they're free, they see what I do, we have a good time, they touch paint, they, they get excited with the idea of touching paint. They're noisy sometimes, but that's part of the whole vibe. And then I have two young men who are also, two young guys, who are also into art and I let them come around, they come paint and then I can give them one or two instructions and, and help give direction at least to what they're doing. So I have three principles that I live my life with and I try and keep it as basic as possible because they're the things that have worked for me all, all this time. One of them is God which I really hold close to my heart um, because um, I've seen how far I've come in believing in him. Secondly, is hard work and humility. Because coming to Nairobi, there's so many people I never used to know. And I feel like I can't really find a solid reason as to why they let themselves work with me. The only thing I keep falling back to is humility. I do exhibitions um, at different times in the year. I might have like, like, like four shows going on in a year. Um, Within a, within a space of two months or three months. I'm also showing in China at the Chinese Expo and uh, Bobo Africa. So that's also another exciting experience. I'm looking forward to see what's going to happen with that. And just like I said, good vibes, man. Um, I'm always grateful to everything that anyone brings.